Hi, I'm Ted. Today I'm going to show you how to run a regression in Excel to find the slope. What I have on my screen is a, a set of data and just for fun I, I, I found some real data. This happens to be the average January temperature for several cities in the United States and the latitude and longitude of the cities. And you might expect that there's a relation between the temperature and the latitude. The farther north you are, the colder it is, obviously. So I've created a, a scatter plot in Excel of that data. And if we want to find the slope of the data, what we do is we use something called a trend line in Excel. Now it might be different on your particular computer and your Excel version, but it's the, the same principles are there. What you do is you select on the uh, uh, select the data, and then you go to you look for a a menu item called trend line. So on my uh, version, under it's under chart layout, and here we have trend line, and you click on that, and you click on linear trend line. Now you can use more complicated trend lines if you're doing something a little more involved with regression, but we're just looking at a linear trend line. So we click on that and we can see the, um, that it's drawn a line, it's a best fit line through the data. Now we want to know what the slope is, so we actually um, click on, and let me just zoom in so you can you see what I'm doing. We click on the trend line and just double click on it and we see that it has, um, the, the, you want to look for options. Options is where is where you're going to actually generate the equation for the chart, uh, the equation for the for the line on the chart, and so we click on equation, display equation, and we say OK, and we see down here there's a y equals the slope. Uh, I'm sorry, y equals the slope times x plus the intercept. I hope this has been useful. I'm Ted. And today I've showed you how to use a regression in Excel to find the slope. Thank you for watching.